Well, next year in Norman, Nebraska and Oklahoma will meet for the first time since 2010. In 2001, Eric Crouch was part of a game against OU that will live on forever in Husker lore thanks to a play simply known as Black 41 Flash Reverse. With NU clinging to a three-point fourth quarter lead over the Sooners, Frank Solich reached into his bag of tricks and pulled out one of the biggest plays in the history of the Nebraska-Oklahoma rivalry. The only ones more surprised than the Sooners by Black 41 flash reverse might have been the Nebraska players themselves. Coach Solich took that out of the game plan. Uh, basically the reason he took it out is because it didn't work all week. So the first time that it, that it had worked was in the game. And uh, it kind of took me a little bit off guard when he called it because um, I think Thursday night or maybe even Friday morning, uh, Coach Gill says, hey, th this play didn't work all week. It's, I mean, I literally remember him taking like a, a Sharpie and scratching it off like the, the play, the game plan for the, for the game. And, <laughs> and you know what? It, I'm glad he called it. I'm glad he put it back in for that play because um, uh, it was a heck of a memory, a great play. The 63-yard touchdown pass from true freshman Mike Stunts to Eric Crouch sent the 246th straight Memorial Stadium sellout crowd into a frenzy as NU would go on to end Oklahoma's 20-game win streak that late October day in Lincoln. I don't remember a time that I've ever heard Memorial Stadium that loud and I've got so many people that come up to me and say, man, I was sitting right here when you had this run and catch and uh, man, it's just such a great memory, and, and uh, I'm glad that I can share that with everyone. Although Crouch's catch catapulted him to the top of the Heisman race and the Huskers to the top of the polls, there was a split-second uncertainty if the senior would reel in the pass. Oh, no, there was a bobble. It was because Mike Stunts was left-handed. So if you don't really understand the, uh, the physics behind that, is that the ball just spins the other way, really. That's the easiest way I can say it. Yes, there was a little bit of a bobble, but... Um, once I got a hold of that thing, I was going to score. Do you ever think of, of what would happen if you dropped it? <laughs> <laughs> you know, I, I think there would be a, a, a loud um, a sigh of disappointment in the stadium. Um, I just couldn't drop that pass, you know. Oklahoma actually ran that earlier in the game. Theirs didn't work, so I was, I was going to make sure ours, ours worked, you know. Credit everybody on that play, blocking, the, the whole thing, Mike Stunts throwing a, a perfect pass. I mean, a dime, a spiral. It, it's just nice to reminisce about these, these plays because they're things that really made a big impact in Nebraska football. After playing at OU in 2021, the Sooners will return the trip to Lincoln in 2022. In the fifth and final part of our series, Crouch gives his thoughts on the future of Husker football, head coach Scott Frost, and quarterback Adrian Martinez.